Hi, it's Z McQueen here with the video on different attacks for Town Hall 9. You want to get those three stars and wars, guys. I know what it is you want. I know what it is you're looking at. Actually, no, you should close out of that other tab on your computer screen. I can see that too. But here's the uh, here are the attacks, guys. I'm going to be sharing a Town Hall 9 three star that involves giants, hogs, and Oh, what else? Dragons! And another attack that involves giants, healers, and queen walk with hogs combined in it. It's super cool, guys. It's super great. Um, let's get started. As you can see here, guys, what I brought to the table was two lightnings and one earthquake what i did was at the very beginning i took out this top right air defense right away just because I, I, I didn't want to look at it i didn't want to have to worry about it during the raid i also brought two giants and the reason i brought that was to get this top left air defense out of the way i wanted to distract this cannon and i wanted to distract the archer tower that was up here that was closest to the air defense and then i sent in six hogs so they could get the cannon and the archer tower out and then after that if i place them in up here at the top again then they will go to that air defense and that's exactly what they did i knew that because i'm smart actually it's just a lot of trial and error guys and then down here i kind of like did a kill squad type of a thing with a king and a queen and yeah you know what heck let's just get this started and you'll see what happened you'll see you'll see so I did the whole zoom in quake thing here boom that one's out of the way and then on this one here it's pretty simple brought down my uh, giants and my hogs here um, I don't know why my giant my second giant didn't lay down again right away or whatever but you know what it worked I got that air defense out of the way then we moved on to this section of the base and it was actually kind of cool it was kind of really cool not really all that cool, but uh, we're just kind of waiting here. I, I could have brought a giant for this one too. I was like, I really don't need it. I was just gonna use the barbarian to tank for the queen. And then I put down three more hogs just to ensure that that air defense was gonna go down. Didn't even really need it. It's okay though. I brought down my dragons down over here. He didn't have anything in his clan castle. At least I don't think so. So I dropped a poison spell on his king. I was like, let's just get that out of the way. Probably should have dropped it on the queen, but you know what? It doesn't even matter. The dragon's pretty strong. Uh, the reason that I can say that this is still a halfway decent attack is just for the fact that these aren't level 4 dragons. And obviously you can get level 4 dragons at Town Hall 9. So, I think for the most part it went pretty well. Uh, there were obviously some things I could have done better. Some things that I could have done worse. And then from here, the, everything's out of my control really. It's just kind of uh, waiting to see where the dragons go, what they do, and things like that. And basic clean up. So, I'll go ahead and let you guys finish watching the rest of this attack, and then we're going to move on to the next one. Now, this was the enemy's attack on... Um, this was our number one for this war. Alexander, he has a... I feel like it's a halfway decent base of I guess not anymore. Now, you can see that these guys modded and were modding or whatever, but they three-starred practically all of our bases. They 99%ed our number uh, three, and they 98%ed our number two. Other than that, everybody was clean in the war. Um, and they did this attack right here, guys. It was about six giants every time, and they used three to four healers healing those giants. And all I did was tank for the queen and the queen went right behind those giants and the queen was hardly touched during the entire attack other than that you send in hogs on the other side of which that your queen and your giants are not attacking and you're gonna throw some heals down on them and that's pretty much gg folks that's gonna be the game let's go ahead and get it started here at the very bottom he placed one giant here first because he assumed that there was a spring track spring trap there goodness i can't talk to save my life it doesn't matter. Um, you didn't click on this video to hear good commentary anyway, did you? I hope you didn't because you'd be disappointed. All right, so from here, he um, raised his queen 
and um, his healer, so uh, everything could be going down all smooth and stuff. Took out the clan castle right away with the help of a poison spell. And on the other side here, he started sprinkling his hogs all about. And I do believe that he sprinkled them all about so they wouldn't trip up traps all at once. Wow, trip up traps. Try saying that three times fast. Trip up traps, trip, trip, trip. All right, I give up. Anyway, we're moving on with the attack. Um, over here, he's still got some things going. He dropped his king over there. Everything's going good for the queen up here. The giants are still doing a great job of tanking. He drops his first heal in that area where there might be a giant bomb, which there was. Uh, good timing on that. If it is modding, I'm just talking over some computers. But you know what? It's still, it is a good attack regardless. So, I mean, obviously, you guys can do this. This can be done. Um, it's a beautiful attack here. Um, still has a heal left for the attack and a poison spell. He uses the poison spell on the skeletons. Um, quite a bit going on at this point. Um, definitely a, more or less a flawless attack, which is why I'm trying to think if there's modding or not. I don't, I don't really know much about modding. I've never done it, obviously, so I can't tell you if it is or not. Uh, maybe you guys will know or whatever. But still, regardless, a good attack, and it's something that you should try out. That's just my suggestion, though. I know. I want to try it out, at least. I've seen this done a couple times before, and it, and it works really well, especially with the extra 30 seconds of time added on. That just helps things that much more. Good attack by Arendelle there. Shout out to him. And if you're modding, you know what? Um, screw you, dude. What are you cheating for? That's pretty much it for this video, guys. I didn't want it to be too long for you. And um, until next time, guys, this is Z McQueen repping the Clash scene. Also, quick shout out to my boy, Raid with Roy. He is... Um, the leader of Barbarian Party, the one that says King Roy as the leader right now. Their clan tag is Y-L-Y-P-U-C-L-O. Go check them out. They're looking for new people to join their clan. Also, big shout out to Klux Khalil. I'm going to leave him as well as Raid with Roy. Their, uh, their YouTube descriptions down in my description jeez i don't i don't even know what I, you know what i'm saying they're gonna be down in the description i might be working with raiders war later and i might be working with clex khalil later later jeez so check them out for sure guys